welcome to another edition of Carbs, our necklace eating Nelly show where I sit in a car and BS while consuming carbs. Go ahead and check out our gaming channel, Zion Mainframe Gaming, by clicking the annotation right there. It'll take you over to our Let's Play channel if you like Let's Plays combined with our personalities. That's the channel for you. So, uh, excuse me if I sound kind of off. One of my ears is plugged up. I woke up and it's just plugged up. It's not earwax because I took a Q-tip in there and that didn't do it. So I actually went to Walmart uh, and after this, I am going to go and uh, wash out my ear and see if that does the trick. If not, it's, it might be an ear infection. I've had them before. Uh, usually they don't clock up my ear though. They just give me immense headaches. So, uh, but yeah, hopefully it's not an ear infection. Do not want to go, oh, burp to the doctor. Also, this is the day where everybody is everywhere. I don't know why. I'm filming this on a Wednesday and there are people everywhere. <laughs> I'm going down these residential streets trying to find a good place to film and there's people outside of their house in every single house. I don't understand what's happening, but okay. Okay, to the review, Taco Bell. This is the new uh, strawberry starburst beverage, ice freeze. I don't remember the exact name and I know I'm gonna get shot in the foot for that one, but uh, this just came out. I didn't even realize it was out until I went through to get something else, which is gonna be tomorrow's review and they had this. So they eliminated the black cherry Mountain Dew freeze, the kickstart one, I believe. That's gone and now they have the strawberry Starburst freeze. That's probably not the name, but who knows? So let's go ahead and try this. I'm not a big fan of Starburst, but I am a big fan of uh, new things being brought in. I think that's a, that's a good idea to kind of not just rely on Mountain Dew for all of your flavors. Let's kind of rotate it around. So let's try it out. It looks awesome. Look at that. That is that's almost radioactive looking. So here we go. Let's try it. The strawberry stop starburst freeze. Hopefully it is strawberry. I'm going off. I'm going off of my thing here, my receipt. So, all right, let's do it. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a starburst all the way. That's some flavor on that thing. That flavor That is beyond sweet. That's too sweet. Huh? It's good. But man, I would get sick of that after maybe like half of it. It's just too much sweetness. My God, it's just liquid candy death. For the price, it's good. I paid a dollar for this thing. One dollar. I think I came during their happy hour. But it's still really good, which happy hour is weird because it's not really happy hour. It's like it's like afternoon hour of happiness. For a dollar and for how good it tastes, it's worth it for sure. It's definitely like just an impulse buy. And I think that is a good thing. It's not something I would go there specifically for, though. I'd have to just be like, I've, dri I've driven up, see it, and I'm like, oh yeah, that sounds good. So I would rate this thing a low four. It's good, just gets a bit too sweet, and I think I would get tired of it overall after you know half of this or so. I might be able to stick it out, but I just don't see it. It's really, really sweet. I do look forward to them branching out to other types of flavors. That sounds pretty good to me. I think uh, it's one of their strong suits of Taco Bell is they're always rotating in brand new stuff. It's a great, great thing for me personally. But what are your thoughts on the strawberry starburst freeze over at Taco Bell? Let me know in the comments down below. And thank you for joining me for this edition of Carbs here on Reckless Eating. We'll see you on the next one. Reckless Eating! Reckless Eating! <laughs>